The Differences Between ROMO and FOMO Before the COVID-19 pandemic, there was the fear of missing out, or FOMO. You worry that what you're doing isn't cool enough or Instagrammable enough. With ROMO, you know it isn't. After COVID-19, the old uncertainty, is my life boring, has been replaced by new and bigger ones. Is it safe to go to the grocery store? Will I lose my job? Will someone I love die? And when will this end? No more FOMO? The pandemic is scary, but one silver lining is the total absence of FOMO. They said it was a relief to have stopped worrying that somewhere friends were having fun without them. The concept of ROMO. ROMO means no traveling, no restaurants, no birthday parties. Choice paralysis have gone out of the window because there are few choices to make. All cancellations can make it seem as if life is on hold, but it's really still moving forward and we will never get back this time. That's the reality of missing out. The effects in the mental health. We have a primitive instinct to connect and build relationships and with COVID-19, the best option is doing that through social media. This can create a distorted reality. Online profiles often show the good stuff or the exaggerated bad stuff. Some will get upset that people aren't commenting or liking their posts. This uneasiness can turn into cognitive distortions such as they must not like me or they've been excluding me. That can lead to anxiety, insecurity, isolation, even depression, and no one is an exception. Focus on you. Over 7.5 billion people are living their lives and very few of them have invited you to come along. Why is this a comfort? Because missing out isn't just anxiety, it's a universal reality. Everyone is missing out all of the time. What really matters is not what you're missing out on, which is almost everything, but what you are doing. Congratulations for completing the video and don't forget to visit the Nomo FOMO website for more information.